So you've just gotten your Axiom Ocularis slingshot and you're ready to get it set up to go shoot. It doesn't get much simpler than the Axiom Ocularis system. However, a couple of things you want to pay attention to. Let's get started. First, you're going to have your frame. It's going to come with the attached lanyard. You'll have a set of bands and a set of Ocularis plugs. So to get started, go ahead and remove your bands from the package. Now all of our bands do come with two tying strips. You can just hang on to those for another type of traditional type slingshot if you wanted to wrap and tuck your bands, or you can just toss them. Now, of course, you want to make sure you tune your bands. Double check your owner's manual to learn how to do that, or visit simpleshot.academy to learn how to tune your bands to your draw length. When we reference the slingshot, we're going to reference the shooter side and the target side. The shooter side is the side with the Simple Shot logo. That's the side that faces you, the side where your thumb and forefinger touch. The target side of the slingshot is the back side of the slingshot, where it says made in the USA and always wear eye protection. When we install the bands, we install the bands from the target side of the slingshot. I'm going to set this slingshot up in the over-the-top configuration. So I'm inserting the bands from the target side of the slingshot. The bands are now inserted through the target side of the slingshot with a tag end on the shooter side of the slingshot. We're going to insert the plug here. So while you're holding the tag in, insert the plug until it's seated. Next, insert the ball bearing. Insert that as deeply as possible. And if need be, you may use something like a, a pen tube or a pencil to push it in even further. We're going to do the same thing for the opposite side. Insert from the target side of the slingshot, fold over the tag end on the shooter side of the slingshot, and insert the plug. Seat the plug as you pull. Install the bearing. All right, now you are attached and ready to shoot. The same method could be done if you wanted to shoot through the forks or somewhere in between. The dial fork system makes it really easy to get your band alignment where you need it in your sight picture. A couple of things to keep in mind. If you're shooting double layer bands, you may not need the ball bearing. If you're shooting very thin bands, such as TheraBand Blue or TheraBand Black, you may need to use a larger bearing or make sure the bearing is inserted deeper. Also, you don't necessarily need to take the bearing out when you change the bands. You can pop it right out and put it right back in. Now here's a trick. Once our tag end is sticking out, we're going to press on the plug as we pull from the target side of the slingshot to help seat the plugs fully. When the plugs are flush, they're seated, and you're ready to shoot. It's the Ocularis Dalla Fork system, super simple and really quick. Thanks for taking a look. Shoot straight, be safe, have fun.